Hi everyone, today we're going to be talking about the task function within Google Calendar. First, what you want to make sure you do is you're going to come over here to the main menu bar and you're going to toggle that open and then you're going to scroll down through your calendars and you want to make sure that you find the task to calendar and you want to make sure that that's toggled on. So I'm going to do that and then I'm going to come back up here and I'm going to get rid of that main menu section and I'm going to come over to the right side and you'll notice there's this little blue circle with a white and um yellow piece inside it, you're going to click that button and that's going to open up your taskbar. All right. Now, within this um, function, you can create multiple task lists. So if you come up here and you click the down arrow and click the create new list, um, and then you want to decide what you want your list to be called. So for this one, I'm going to come up with tasks for a staff meeting. And I'm going to click done. And that will create your task list. And then you're going to start adding tasks. So maybe um, for this meeting, I want to make sure there's a schedule. I also want to make sure that there, the room is available. And then I also want to print handouts. And all of these things um, need to be done before this staff meeting. So that's why I have these in tasks. Now, these tasks will not show up in your calendar until you give them a date. So within uh, each task, you want to click on the pencil and that will open up the screen. You can add more details if you would like um, or if you just need like a reminder. Uh, and then you're going to click the add date bar and then you're going to decide which date you want to add it to. I'm going to do uh, April 2nd. And then you can even add subtasks. So maybe you need to do something um, or multiple things in order to get this single task done. So you can add subtasks if you would like. Once you've done that, you're going to click the back arrow and it usually takes a second. Um, but after that, you'll notice that it's going to pop up within your calendar at the top. So it doesn't have a specific time, but it has a date. And then you can go through and add dates to your other ones. Um, that you have for, for this single task list. And then if you want to create multiple task lists, you can do that again up here. Now, once you have that done, um, you, all you have to do is click the X and your task is there and ready to go. Um, so I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial on how to use the task function within Google Calendar.